first question incorrectly spelt words substantially sentimentally subsequently and a solicitation see all these three words are l y l y l y what are they adjectives or adverbs adverbs solicitation ending with t i o n they are all non forms look at the first one substance or substant substantiation you should learn all these connecting words here okay first uh, what is the non form for substantially what is the non form substance is non form what is the v1 substantiate okay next what is adjective substantial what is adverb form substantially what is the error here can you find an error in the first word no next one what else do we have sentiment sentimental sentimentally sentiment is noun sentimental is adjective and sentimentally is adverb okay can you find any error no error case eliminate that we need to find only incorrect word next one subsequent what is spelling of subsequent s u b s e q u subsequent e u is missing here okay what in by subsequent subsequent meaning the next later which comes later next solicitation solicitation is to request or ask yeah what is the only incorrectly spelled word here third one okay you might also come across what is the correctly spelled word that means three will be wrong and one will be correct you should be very much careful even in the case of question next move to 77 it was difficult to dash gopal to watch a horror movie now gopal gopal is a boy who doesn't watch horror movies he is afraid of horror movies now it is very difficult or it was very difficult to is followed by v1 persuade parts of speech v1 consult parts of speech v1 confer parts of speech v1 dissuade parts of speech v1 dissuade is to prevent somebody stop somebody from doing something confer is to come face to face confront somebody next one consult is to take a help consult the doctor take take the help from the doctor next another one is persuade persuade is to control persuade is to motivate persuade is to make somebody to do something okay now simply you can go with the meaning of motivate now tell me your answer what is your answer it is difficult to make him to watch the movie now where do you get the meaning of the word make him to do something that is persuading persuade is nothing but making somebody to do something it is just like see have you watched this uh, movie anywhere somewhere like uh, you know in the, in the um, uh, psychology case hypnotism like whatever you tell them they do whatever you tell them they imagine that is nothing but persuading okay controlling some other person next move to 78 you have to get the meaning sorry synonym and antonym of the word fallacy fallacy is positive or negative okay forget about the meaning once come to the options tricking somebody what in between tricking somebody trick is nothing but cheat and cheat is nothing but flaw flaw is nothing but mistake making some mistake or making some flaw cheat trick these four are synonyms what else is there here truth being truthful is not cheating now tell me what is the antonym here fallacy is nothing but flaw cheat or trick they are all synonyms and only antonym is truth being truthful next move to 79 an imaginary ideal society free of poverty and suffering what is it called as this is one word substitution this is one word substitution important word only the world or the place which is free of poverty and suffering what is it called as of course everything looks like same paradise sir in paradise we don't have any problem uh, heaven sir in heaven we don't have any poverty any problem always uh, all uh, enjoyment only ramba parvasi menaka no no it is not that okay this is an ideal society we are speaking about free of poverty and uh, suffering what is it called as it is called as utopia remember this word very important one in the case of one word substitutions 
next fair and square get the idiomatic expression G idiomatic meaning fair and square first of all this is positive idiom now tell me the meaning of the idiom by any means available calm and quiet beautiful in appearance according to the rules he played fair and square what do you mean by that he played according to the rules he followed all the rules that is called as fair and square that comes with the fourth one next move to 81 have you got the answer what is your answer in the first sentence i will underline one word tell me whether it is starting one or not first one is the lion is it starting no lion is common on here you cannot use it directly next one he took another portion another one is he too can we use pronouns in the beginning no so we can eliminate a b and also c what is remaining only d is remaining so what is there in d let us check look at this starter i told you this many times once once upon a time once upon a time there was a all these can be used as the starters and all the stories start with this type of starters now what is your starting word only d how many options are there with d two options one is dc another one is da now what is there in d let us check the meaning once a lion went hunting with three other beasts check for c he took the last portion because an accident uh, would befall anyone who laid pawn or paw on it other one is a when it was time to divide the spoils the lion took one portion for his title as a king of the forest see there are other three beasts together they went for the hunting now after the hunting it was time for the separation like whatever they hunted they might for must be divided among them now which is the correct combination here da or dc DA. only da is possible how many options we have with da fourth one that is the answer next move to 82 synonym of the word poignant it is called as poignant g is actually silent here g is silent poignant okay not poignant it is poignant poignant what do you mean poignant like pitiful pitiful <clears throat> pity <clears throat> sad case generally anything that happened for you very badly and you remember it for another time for the second time okay quite beautiful touching happy you need synonym here tell me for example after watching the movie uh, sita ramam you feel very poignant right what do you mean by that you feel very sad you may feel very pity you feel very pitiful for sita yes or no uh, now what is that word tell me here that is touching you call it as heart touching movie that is third one next 83 sentence improvement is needed and the phrase is not highlighted the phrase must be fell over that is a phrasal verb he fell over in studies owing to his illness owing to in the sense because of owing to means because of now fell over fell over is nothing but to fall down literally fall down on the ground is called as fell over okay next another one fell out fell out is to get separated it is simply just arguing arguing simply to get separated next fell for what is fell for or fall for exactly to be attracted to someone is called as fall for someone uh, that is nothing but I fell for her English translation I fell for her that is English translation uh, okay next one fall behind fall behind is nothing but lag now tell me your answer he fell over in studies fell out get an argument fell over fall down fell for get attracted all lag behind we are speaking about a reason here what is the reason here because of his illness what we can use here he lagged behind that is the third one next 84 
the weather is much more warmer than it was a few days before the statement is in which degree tell me positive degree comparative degree superlative degree comparative degree why you can clearly see then what type of degree is needed here comparative degree is needed again now warmer is what here comparative degree what is a positive degree for this warm what is a comparative degree warmer what is superlative degree warmest can we use more or most impossible eliminate that next we have one more word here what is this one here much what is much here that is adverb and warmer is nothing but adjective we can use this combination with the case of noun i told you this structure yesterday much is nothing but the adverb of degree adverb of degree okay so what is the error here what do you have to use what is the error here more is the error eliminate more there is your answer next 85 select the option that expresses the given sentence in active voice that means the statement is already in the passive you have to change it into active if you have to change that into active what you have to focus here you have to focus on the helping verb and the main verb i am paid so can we say this is a structure of is am are plus a v3 this is the given structure okay this is a structure now this is the passive voice structure of which active voice this is the passive voice of simple present now what is structure of simple present subject plus v1 or v5 now you have to come across v1 or v5 i by my organization now tell me your answer paid me will pay pays me would pay which is the correct answer tell me paid is nothing but v2 which tense is that simple past tense will pay is nothing but will plus v1 which tense is that simple future pays is nothing but here v5 which tense is that simple present organization would pay would pay comes again as the v1 case used with the modal it can come by used in the simple present only simple present comes with the third one now look at these two sentences my organization pays me weekly what is the sentence here i am paid weekly by my organization is that clear you can go with the third one next move to 86 synonym of the word calm cranky relaxed joyful clean calm i am calm i am very relaxed cranky is nothing but a disturbed a mad person anybody who is disturbed a disturbing person or a disturbed person this is completely antonym we need synonym here relaxed is positive joyful is positive and clean is also positive remember but we need exact word for this what is the exact word here calm and uh, relaxed both are synonyms next move to 87 have you heard this phrase hustle bustle hustle bustle what in way hustle bustle asal bustle in the sense hurry bury hurry bury hurry bury ante em ledu thora thara ga idan cheyadanna hurry bury ananta now we need antonym for this hustle is nothing but can be used as stress same meaning comes with annoyed same meaning also comes with a worried four two and one these three are synonyms now we need antonym here what is antonym you can use i am relaxed he is hustled and i am relaxed so what is the answer here only third one next move to 88 give the meaning of the idiom sit on the fence sit on the fence or sit on the wall both could be given sometimes what do you mean by sitting on the fence see india sat on the fence during russia's invasion what do you mean by that like nearly 5 to 10 countries they supported russia and another 5 to 10 countries directly they express their support directly to ukraine but india is a country which neither supported ukraine nor russia this is nothing but sitting on the fence it is just like undecided not to move here not even to move here sitting on the fence undecided way which is the option tell me now protecting something creating conflicts avoid making a decision poke fun at the people what is your answer avoid making a decision next 89 you can just simply answer this whole just with the help of please ordered requested threatened 
again please help please help please help cannot be used in direct indirect speech what is the answer tell me yeah. only request her let us check the meaning now raj said to his friend please help me in this task now look at the sentence given raj requested his friend to help him in this task changes to the task these changes to those today changes to correct na uh, tomorrow changes to yesterday changes to so changes to so changes to ego changes to ego changes to here changes to remember these words at least with the help of these small small words you can simply identify the indirect speech next move to 90 one word substitute for the given sentence a dynamic campaign for political social religious change this is basically related to history if you know some of the historical wars and all you can answer this this is important political social and religious campaign is nothing but let us say wars some wars which happen for political social and religious reasons what are they called as conflict conflict is nothing but some argument some disturbance some problem war you already know mutiny is nothing but some rebellion rebel basically who is a rebel <laughs> prabhasa <laughs> prabhasa option undadu mara akada <laughs> what do you answer then who is a rebel rebel is someone do you know mr krishnam raju member of parliament yeah he is called as a rebel mp why one who turns against his own party one who turns against his own people is called as rebel don't connect it to prabhas movie that is different case okay now a dynamic campaign for political social or religious change that is called as crusades vitne mata yuddhalu antaru telugu lo basically muslim chesina yuddhalu ante matanni spread cheyadaniki jarigina yuddhalane crusades an antam to spread the religion there were some wars in the history they are called as crusades campaigns or wars which happened for the political social or religious changes they are all crusades next 91 again rearrangement the festival can we use this directly in the beginning festival is what type of noun here common noun and what did we add here the is added if at all common noun is added with the don't give priority in the beginning so eliminate b next the hornbill festival is the most anticipated cultural carnival of what is given here at last this state which state do you have any clarity no eliminate that next um, located in north east india nagaland this is a state okay nagaland is very beautiful and an ethnically diverse state so can we consider as introduction somewhere it feels like next the hornbill is often displayed on the traditional tribal headgears worn during naga festivals now see here we have the hornbill festival which happens as the naga festival and above we have nagaland we have already eliminated a and b now what is the answer tell me c or d only c the festival which happens in nagaland is called as naga festival so only c is the starter how many options you have with c only first one now let us check the context located in northeast india nagaland is very beautiful and an ethnically diverse state continuation the honorable festival is the most anticipated carnival of this state this and in tikada nagaland state next the festival which festival here the hornbill festival is named after indian hornbill continuation the hornbill is often displayed indian hornbill is nothing but we are speaking about the horns do you know nagaland people they wear this type of uh, you know pagdi on the top with the horns made up of horns we see some of the tribal people from the adilabad and pradachram also okay they wear this type of horns and all they are this called nothing but hornbill the hornbill is often displayed in the traditional tribal headgears headgear in the sense which is worn on the head during naga festival so clearly we can go with the combination of first one next move to 92 find out the incorrectly spelt word you must answer this 
criticism, censure, helicopter, approval. What is your answer? Uh, that you already know, right? Chinna punnandi manam H ante H for helicopter, A for apple. Ivanne me chinna par chadu kunna be. Okay na? What is the meaning of the word criticism? Criticize or criticism? Criticism. Criticize is to oppose. Criticize is to speak against somebody. Criticize is to sometimes rebuke also. Criticize is to scold also. Criticize is to negate. Next, censure. What is censure? Do you know censor team? Censor team. What is censor team? Where does, where does it work? In the movies. Before the movie could be released, there is a censor team. Censor team, what does it do? What does it do? Whatever the unnecessary portions, whatever the scenes that are not suitable to the public, they censure it. Censure is to cut short, eliminate, remove, shortcut. Next, approval is approval is acceptance or agreement. So only error comes with the third case. Next, 93. Find out the error. The visitors complained at the poor accommodation they were provided during the tour. Now, the visitors is nothing but subject here. It can be considered as they. Complained is nothing but here V2. They plus V2, subject verb agreement is absolutely fine. Whenever you approach errors, remember, first step is subject verb agreement. Remember this always. Subject verb agreement in the sense, subject helping verb and helping verb with the main verb. First check these three always. Then go for the any other error. Now, is the subject and verb clear? Absolutely. They plus a V2 can be combined. Next, what else we have? Complained at. Complained at. Can we use that combination? When you complain somebody, when you complain, what is it called as? You complain at somebody or complain about somebody? You complain about somebody. Fight at someone or fight against someone? Fight against someone. So these are all negative words and we need negative combinations here. Okay. So complain about the poor accommodation, about this, about him. Next, 94. Fill in the blank. She knew that to apologize would dash to admitting she had failed. We need to combine the word which comes with combination of two. Translizing to, tandem to, tangible to, tantamount to. First of all, you look at the word that is given before. What is this in here? Modal. modal verb. All the modal verbs are directly followed by V3, V1 or a B plus V3 or B plus adjective. Okay. Look at this one. Translizing can be used as V4. It can also be used as adjective. Tandem is nothing but a noun form. This means nothing but anything that is in a line or row. Next, tangible. The words which end with I-B-L-E or B-L-E. What are they called as? Adjectives. Tangible in the sense, any physical substance which is visible. Okay. Next, uh, tantamount. Tantamount in the sense, anything that is equivalent. Now, tell me the options that can be eliminated. Can you use before tantalizing in the before? In the beginning? No. Eliminate that. Tantum is noun. Eliminate that. Adjective cannot be used. Tantamount can be used as verb and also it can be used as adjective. Now, what is the only V1 we have here? Fourth one. And remember, we have to combine that with the two. Tantamount to in the sense equal to something. Now look at the sentence, complete sentence. What is the sentence given? She knew that to apologize would tantamount to admitting she had failed. What do you mean by that? Sometimes when you argue with somebody, arguing against somebody, if your elders come and tell you, say sorry, do you say no? Why do you say? Why do you say no, I won't tell you? Because you don't want to feel like that you had failed, that you are wrong. So when you say sorry, it is equal to something which I have done 
wrong same sentence here she knew that apologize that means asking forgiveness is equal to she had failed so that is nothing but tantamount to that comes with the fourth one next move to 95 50 liters of milk are donated by the committee change the highlighted phrase 50 liters of milk countable or uncountable uncountable all the uncountable nouns must be treated as only singulars how many singular verbs are there here r r is what is correct here only is no connect 50 liters of milk is donated by the committee active voice or passive voice passive voice is plus v3 okay your answer is four next move to 96 close test the first human beings to control fire gradually not beings there the first human um, you can use some other verb there because that is wrong the first human write it as began began verb is needed the first human began to control fire gradually v2 is needed v2 v2 after gradually keep comma after gradually keep comma okay this is next sentence learned dash many uses now tell me your answer it's many uses his many uses their many uses your many uses what are we speaking about here fire fire is treated as what here it's okay that can be used as the first one next 97 not only did they all the do forms are followed by only v once only do does or did all of them are followed by only v1 now how many v ones are there now use prepare use decide out there ready ready is that verb there no ready is what adjective so eliminate that we need only verb here so how many verbs are there now prepare and use use fire to keep warm or prepare fire to keep warm you use something to keep yourself warm so what is your answer here first one next 98 not only did they use fire to keep warm and cook their food the dash learned to use it in hunting not only this but also this so what is the combination here also next 99 to kill insects to dash berries and to clear forests to safeguard berries berries in the sense fruits okay now to safeguard berries to acquire berries to attain berries to obtain berries acquire attain and obtain these three are related to knowledge wisdom knowledge acquire knowledge attain knowledge obtain knowledge learn something that is related to learning now what are we speaking about here berries can we use this combination of these three words the next three words no what do you need here only safeguard safeguard is to save protect protect berries and to clear forests of unbrush so that game dash be better seen game could be better seen game will be better seen game must be better seen game shall be better seen tell me the odd one out tell me the odd one out remember all of them are modal verbs only can you find that could is modal verb will must shall all of them are modal verbs there is some difference here what is it two three four these are all treated as the present b forms the only past b form is could and what are we speaking about here first human beings and what is used here seen referring to the past case so what is the only past verb here could be seen at the past time so can you check all the closed test options what are they all five options are only one okay 